All right, today we're gonna bring a wire tracker and this is a couple of things that you should know that's included. They give you the charging station for the actual wiring tracker system itself. They give you the little hammer and a punch down so you can actually feel some of the cable underground or in through the walls. Uh, they give you, uh, of course, they give you another uh, connection. This one's actually headphones, all right? If you don't want anybody to hear the noise that it makes. Uh, the tracker itself has a, a gooseneck stretchable um, tracking device. Instructions are included. The bag's included. They give you a nine volt battery. And we're gonna put it to a test to see how well it works. All right, so we have a demo here so you guys can see. I have them plugged into a regular cable right now. I'm gonna show you on the external part of it what you can do, all right? So right now, on the actual system device, you have analog, and this is an analog. So we're gonna do analog, you have continent, and then you have digital. So we're not gonna do any of the other two. We're just gonna do the analog. Uh, these are multi-functions. I'm gonna show you a couple things that you should be aware of for the strength of the actual meter reader, right? So we're gonna turn it on, hold down the power button, all right? And it tells you what's gonna be looking for, if it needs charge or anything else. Right now we're in the middle, but you can lower it down to lower the actual beeping sound. And you guys can see that, and then higher. The thicker the, the actual uh, continent is, the thicker that you're gonna require to go higher voltage on it so you can start looking for it. So that means if you have a thicker pipe or it's a underground pipe, maybe you wanna keep it to the highest one, all right? The deeper it is, the higher you're gonna to wanna to look for your connection, all right, and follow it. The second one, you wanna lower it down. We're gonna keep it to the middle right now so you guys can see how it works. The device itself, easy to turn on. We're gonna turn it on by hitting the button, by hitting the power button here, all right? Once you see it, a little light comes on. This is a LED light if you're working at night or in the dark, LED light. You wanna conserve some power, turn off the LED light. Um, scan, I'm gonna show you what that means, all right? So right now, you don't see anything. You don't hear anything. But if I hear here, it beeps once, it beeps again, and it skips. But if you hit the scan, it's a constant scan. And then back to one. The scan is what you want. So right now, if you guys can see it, I'm gonna show you the meter. I'm gonna put this on the meter itself, all right, on the system, and you can hear it scanning. But because we have a lower, we're gonna hire the audio. And that's because of the thickness, all right? So this thing, so if you're doing underground work, now let's run this on the pipe. Pretending we're underground, all right? Let's go ahead and do that. All right, so today we're gonna bring this, we're gonna test it out, and we have a galvanized pipe. If you guys notice, we have it plugged in on the negative and positive. I'm a little close, that's where you're gonna hear it. So let's go ahead and test it out on the galvanized pipe. See it right now we're getting a high tone all right this is a galvanized pipe 